After Russia invaded Ukraine in 2022, millions of Ukrainian families fled the country, becoming refugees. I'm here because of the war. Olga Morganova and her son came to the United States about a year and a half ago. Everything was like diff difficult for me, everything. Now she's settled in and works as a case manager with Catholic Charities to help other refugees make the same adjustment. When you have someone who tells you, you can do this, you, you feel your power inside, you really can do this. Catholic Charities meets refugees as soon as they get off the plane. On Wednesday, they greeted 21 newcomers. At least three different larger families. Um, they're coming from all over. Jesse Crawford, the housing coordinator, says they need help finding a place for these families to stay, preferably three and four bedroom houses. The housing market as it stands right now is difficult for even, you know, <laughs> folks who aren't refugees to navigate. Permanent housing for people, it's like first step. It's a ground which like to build the steps. Olga says they always try to keep families together. Catholic Charities has helped to house large groups in the past. Both of these families are originally from the Central African Republic. Now they live in Southeast Portland. Right now it's kind of, uh, it's kind of crunch time. Crawford says these new families will be in hotels until they can find somewhere else to go. Without the kindness of others, it would be a real, real struggle for them to get their feet under them. Every help, even if it's little bit, it will be helpful. Ashley Grams, KGW News.